If you like our video, click the subscribe button to subscribe to our channel and get easy access to new content. To see our full suite of ad-free video courses and training materials, visit us at teachucomp.com. Combo box controls and access let you create drop-down menus and forms from which users can select a choice to make an entry within a field. The choices available in the combo box menu can come from a table or query, or you can type your own list of values from which the users can select. These controls can reduce the amount of data entry error in a field by limiting the range of data entry choices. If you created a lookup field within an access table, it automatically appears as a combo box control if you add the field to a form from the field list when using form design or layout view. Combo box controls are almost always exclusively used by forms, not reports. This is because reports are read-only and you often use the combo box to update values in an underlying data source. Before you add a combo box control to a form in Access, ensure you enable the Use Control Wizards button by clicking the More arrow in the lower right corner of the scrollable list of controls in the Controls button group on the Design tab of the Form Design Tools contextual tab in the ribbon to show its drop-down menu. Ensure the Use Control Wizards button is highlighted, which means it is enabled. If not highlighted, click the button in the drop-down menu to enable it. To then add a combo box control to a form in Access, open the form in Form Design View. Then click the Combo Box button in the scrollable list of controls in the Controls button group on the Design tab of the Form Design Tools contextual tab in the ribbon. Then click and drag over the area within the form where you want to place the combo box. If the Use Control Wizards button is enabled, then when you release the mouse button, you create the combo box control and open the Combo Box Wizard dialog box. Answer the questions posed to you in each screen of the combo box wizard to choose how the combo box should get its data. Then click the next button after answering questions in each screen until you reach the last screen. Then click the finish button to create the combo box control within the form. Remember to click the subscribe button to see more of our videos. Get ad-free courses at teachucomp.com.